Hey, this is Tiger24, and I'm back with another video. And in this video, I'm going to be speaking on the Nike Misery Ridge jacket that I had picked up last spring. I've been meaning to drop that video, but before I get into that, um, I took a break off of this YouTube for a month due to COVID. Caught it at my job from a coworker. And yeah, man, the effects on this is crazy. Like, I feel tired all the time. My taste buds. It's not 100% there, and I'm always thirsty. Speaking of that. But since then, I have went to the polo outlet and the regular polo store. I picked up four jackets, four jackets in total. I had as well. And I also picked up some shoes, you know? I'm gonna drop a video on these. And this is just a hint. It's an Adidas shoe. So yeah, this is Adidas as well. Plus, I got a Nike shoe. Um, let me push this to the side. This is the jacket right here. It's the Misery Ridge. Show you the inside on it of this. Man, when I picked up this jacket, I got it at the Soho store, you know, in Manhattan. And here's some of the details I love. This is all stitch. It's not that laminated glue-on thingy. Damn, should have dropped this on the floor. It's a little dusty. But, um, but yeah, man, it has that right there. The same thing for this piece right here. And also has like a little check in the back. But when I picked this up, there was no sales on this at the time. And it was sold out all across New York. And this is a solid $450. But I ended up getting it for $375 with my man's discount. He ended up hooking me up. But when I got this, you know, things happen for a reason. I, w I was originally going to order this online at Extra Small because... Nike jackets tend to run very big on me. I'm only 5'6", 162 pounds. And by the grace of God, they only had this in a small. And I'm glad I picked it up in a small. It fits a little roomy. I'm gonna show you. It's supposed to be roomy because, oh man, you wanna be able to layer a fleece and a down under this because this jacket alone is not going to keep you warm in the winter time if you notice there's a lot of room up here in the arms which even if you wore this alone you could just you know tighten it up but i like to leave it loose it comes with four pockets um two down here as you can see two over here which is dope. And one of the nicest things that I like about this jacket is that it has two big um, deep pockets right here. And it also has a drawstring if you want to tighten this up. And what's really dope about this is the pit zips. I'm gonna show you a little up close. So you see how big it is. See how long that extends? That goes to the bottom of the jacket, which is very, very nice. And yeah, man, they got a total of um, six pockets, four up top, two on the bottom. And it has a drawstring for the hoodie as well. Throw this on and kind of show it to you. It goes right here. And when you zip this up, it does cover up to your nose, which is pretty cool. And yeah, man, for 375 I think I paid a total of 400 with tax and everything, but this is the main jacket that I had wanted when I said I wanted to get into Tickway. This reminds me of that Alpine jacket from 2017. It also has a drawstring on the back of the hood. I would say from a solid one out of 10, I'm gonna rate this like a nine and a half. Nine and a half. The construction on this jacket is A1. The fit is nice. It looks good. 
And with this jacket, I would say um, the accessories make it, you know? I have some accessories that I have bought, a couple of hats, gloves, and everything, and I'm going to drop it on a future video, show you how I styled this jacket. And I like this so much, I ended up picking this up in a second color. And it's a color that I don't usually get jackets in, but it's still dope. I may pick this up in a third color, most definite. You know, the I learned from, from the old jacket, I should have picked up the black one and the olive, but I had slept on it. And by the time that I tried to pick it, up, pick it up, it was already sold out. But yeah, man, from one out of 10, Tell me what you guys rate this jacket. You know what? You know what I mean? Like, I'll throw it on again. Give you a look. Quick look of it again. And the pit zips, look. See that? From up here, I can extend this all the way down here. And just the construction of this. You know? It's beautiful. Also, with this on like this, and if you got the zip like this, you can also reach in and grab something you have in here. You don't have to open up this jacket if you don't want to, you know. So, and that that was one of the major um, things that I wanted was a fit zip and an inside inside deep pocket. But yeah, from one to ten, I rate this nine and a half or even a ten. I, I'll I'll give this a ten, just the overall construction and quality is is a1 i love this jacket and please like sub subscribe and comment and tell me what you think would you get this jacket and what do you guys rate it and what are your pickups for the um winter